So the iClone 8 version 2 video just dropped. Let's have a look at the comparisons between iClone and Blender. So in this first clip, we can see an iClone that they're bringing in a video clip and then kind of rotoscoping uh, their animation. Now, this is something that we can do in Blender as well. A little bit of fiddling around and Blender crashes for me. <laughs> and we get it working again and I'm using Auto Rig Pro and you can see just kind of like it's a little bit finicky compared to what iClone's doing and how they're achieving this kind of setup. I really like what they've done here where you can select the current pose and then simply click the mirror button and it flips that pose. In Blender, you can go Control C to copy the pose and Control Shift V to flip the pose. One last thing that I really like is the curves that you can actually play with. You've got a pretty big selection here by the looks of it. However, in Blender, it's fairly limited. So I'm really looking forward to getting my hands onto iClone 8 and just... Mm especially with Character Creator 4. <laughs>